27 in a row. That's the current winning streak for the South Dakota State football team going into tonight's playoff game against Albany. That includes 20 straight wins at Dana J. Dykehouse Stadium in Brookings. That's where we find Dakota News Now Sports Director Mark Oven in the night as the Jacks look to punch their ticket to Frisco. Hey there, Mark. Hi, right, Cordell, how are you? I am standing by here live at Dana J. Dykehouse Stadium with Dana J. Dykehouse, my longtime buddy. Um, I don't think I know of a bigger Jackrabbit supporter than you. How cool is it? I know you were excited before the very first game to know that so many of the games are sold out. How cool is it for you to see this stadium be, to be full so many times? Oh, year? it's been so much fun this year to see that happen. You know, it's our fans have really started showing up, and we've had a lot of success. Three uh, semifinals in a row, that's a pretty big deal. Well, and, and of course, last year, the big win in Frisco. This is a special team. I mean, to have the same group of guys basically back from last year, uh, I don't know that the fans realize how special and how lucky they are to see this special team. Well, and these guys all stuck together. I mean, they could have gone on. A lot of them have graduated already because of that COVID year. Some are in their sixth year of football. They stuck together. They wanted to repeat in Frisco, so we'll see if they can get it done. It's, uh, it's hard to believe. You know, I used to uh, have to climb steps to get up to the top, top of Coffin Alumni Stadium to shoot games and maybe to get a, a meal before the game started. This place is pretty nice that you've uh, contributed to. How proud are you of all? Or well, how proud are you of all of this? Yeah, Mark, real proud of this place. It's been it's a great stadium. You know, we uh, traveled around, looked at a lot of different stadiums, and there's a lot of good ideas we picked up around the country that we put into this stadium. So I think we got our money's worth. All right, no question about it. And and the the, the national exposure you guys are getting is hard. It's you know, you can't put a price tag on that. No, it really isn't. And uh, But, you know, we, we talk nationally and everything, but on this team, there's a lot of South Dakota kids. And I think that's what our fans really like. You know, the Yankee boys are from Madison. Uh, last year, Tucker Kraft from Timberlake. Uh, this year, Mason McCormick from all the way from Sioux Falls Roosevelt. So, I mean, this is a lot of fun. All right, have fun tonight. Thanks, Mark. You bet. Jack Rabbits and Albany coming up here in just a few minutes on ESPN2. Back to you.